Welcome back to the Black Parade. Mission 7, The Long Shadow Falls. Unfortunately, we saw the guard leave his post just a second ago, but uh, which would have been the perfect time to run across and try picking the lock on the uh, security door there. Except that some annoying person walked right past uh, while that was happening, so ruining my opportunity. Maybe we get another one soon. Is that the civilian coming by on the down the corridor there? No, that's the guard with the dog. Okay, well, it's a good thing I wasn't too close. Oh, there goes the guard. Alright, here's my moment. Here's my moment. Dang, it needs a fucking key. I guess we found out how those cameras work. They stop and go bar if they see you. I guess they called me. Alright, we need a key for the security room. Of course we do. Oh, I'm, 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 I'm an idiot. We read the damn letter. The captain of the guard has the key to the security room. We can't just pick the lock. Okay, where's the guard captain live? It wasn't in the basement. I mean, there's no guard quarters here. There's no barracks marked. There's a bunch of rooms around the kitchen, maybe? Right, servants would be around the kitchen. Maybe guards would be? I, I mean, unless they're in the basement. Private study, greenhouse. No, that's not going to be guards. A couple of rooms near the ballroom could be guard quarters. Alright, how about I try heading east and south? Let's see what we get there. And that would be where they uh where the man and his dog just went. Find me, there's nobody there, you didn't see anything. What am I looking at? This room. This is not guard quarters. What is this? Definitely not guard quarters. I mean, there's guards in here. Damn periscope here too? No, it's a spotlight, okay. Just thought the surprise was silent. That's a nice little niche to observe from. Yeah, the guards wouldn't be up here. Where, where would the guard captain be? Captains. Which way are you going, sir? Gonna stand there, huh? Well, Lady Godiva there is, uh. What a grand old time. Um, da, da. Better make a move. Da, 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 da. Stay in one place, but I don't know whether it's a good place to be staying. For the last time, you keep an eye on the gallery. Don't let any servants come close to the ruby. Got it? But what have they got to clean the pedestal? I mean, them servants always clean stuff. Again, for the last time, they don't have to clean it. And if they do try to get close, you bop them on the head and report to the captain. It's not hard to understand now, is it? Oh, oh yeah, I see. But 
What if I want to take a close look at the ruby? It's shiny and pretty. Should I bop myself on the head and report that to the captain? How does that work? Why, oh, why, oh, I always end up working with you, of all people. Just, uh, get it. Who is there? Is someone there? Uh, oh, oh. Nobody's here. Why do you have to walk through the damn dark corridor, are you? Just trying to see where these guys were going. Whoever you are. <sighs> Actually, you're probably better off right there. Again, you didn't actually see me, but I'm just paranoid about... Because the early missions... Is, and, well, the read me, and then the early missions established that... Yeah, guards will notice you if they walk into you, and it's like... Well, okay. So I... There's someone there? If, if you're walking into me, I'm, you're gonna... Then I expect... You're gonna see me, even if it doesn't happen... Imagining things. Immediately. It's like a game room. Uh, I mean, we came down the stairs, right? Yeah, that's the game room. Well, if I head south, let's use my markings again. Or where I've been. Well, I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter. Hmm. Guess it was nothing. When are they going to bring me my dinner? That's what I want to show. When are they going to bring me my dinner? Here come this way. Footsteps all over here. What's this door on the west? What's the door west? Well, I could through the foyer instead of the ballroom, which might be less noisy. Who's that? Oh, this is. No, this is the inner garden? Hang on, I'm looking at the wrong floor. Yeah, yeah, inner garden. Okay, so this is outdoors, and this is nice and quiet. There's a periscope here. Oh, the foyer is going to be a problem, isn't it? Again. Oh god, he was coming straight out the door I was coming out. Good thing I moved. Hello, post carrier? What was that noise? I don't know, just the sound of precious, filthy Luca leaving your way. God in the ballroom. Now oh, this is impossible. Well, it's not impossible, but it's uh, not really viable, right? No, that's not doable. I could cut across there if I was getting across the whole way, but... Well, maybe I can dodge around here and then cut across. I don't even know if I'm going the right way, you know. I don't hear anybody about to hear my footsteps. No, here comes somebody to hear my footsteps. I don't know if that's Duval himself, but he looks a bit portly, you can... Like that's the butler to me, right? Yeah. Hello? Show yourself. Shit, 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 shit. Oh my god, he's going to get... get help. <gasps> On a tree! Unless he's going to sound the alarm. I'm surprised the uh, periscope didn't turn the alarm. We were kind of just in full view of it. I was just panicking. This is not the right place to be. 
It's a small dining room. While we're here, I suppose. Someone's surely going to be coming back in a second. Tell me, I need to go in, go in, go inside. <sighs> kitchen, kitchen. Feels like it's going to be a whole lot safer. Maybe not through. Let the scullery maid know that the saucier has clogged the sink with the mixtures again. I have no idea what the man put down there this time, but it reeks of rotten eggs. There is some old white vinegar left in the cellar. She can use that if it's of any help. By the way, his lordship has had enough of gabble wings and wants something more exotic and spicy. Do you, any of you know of some Herobotian recipes by any chance? Oh, mince. I fell on making this sauce. I should start once again. God, this is a fancy French cook. So he's going to... Okay, that's just going to be a lot of stuff. Maybe there's more. I feel like I want to... Be checking it out. Well, I want to be checking those out too. Mm. But this. I guess that's... Where he went? He sounded like he was. I don't understand. They're doing good meals, good for their health, and they are still complaining all the time. That's a weirdly dramatic thing. Hello. <sighs> oh, that's quite nice. That's what's been noting. Oh, we got the custom font again, or, or something fucked about it without the vertical bar, which is really annoying. Maybe I use double quotes to indicate a, pa a vertical passage, because I usually use double pipes. I guess that does the trick. Kinda. If I can position it correctly. Kind of awkward. Okay, and then yeah, yeah. No yeah. worry, that'll do. I can read that. Oof, smoky. I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm stuck. Cool, cool, cool. I can't even man. Ah. Uh. Stuck on everything. Check your collision boxes, people. Don't make a tiny, tiny space where you get stuck in every object. It's the most annoying thing. Yes, it's the engine's fault. Yes, you know you have to pull to stop it happening. Guess it was nothing. Who said that? <sighs> this damn tiny metal. I guess that's out there. Oh, there's a bigger table for the one that. Ugh. Wow, alright. So that's the pantry. This is not going to be guards, right? None of that's bed guard bedrooms. Do we have to go back down to the basement again? I mean, this doesn't mark doors, I suppose, but there's too many doors, too many doorways for those to be. 
bedroom, surely. I mean, I can check. That's a balcony. I could go in the garden door, I could eat. That's... I think I saw. Who's this civilian guy saying? Yeah, it was nothing, I guess. Was it you up there in the damn tower? I I saw you saw nothing, you spectating spelunker. Definitely not guards' quarters. Well, there's a guard with a purse, so you know it's not a, not a dead loss. <sighs> Probably gonna walk back across this way though, right? Just to liven my life up. <sighs> like he, he loves to come and stand out of the rain. Yep. Huh? No, no, okay. You, you did. You only came a few steps this time. Stop jumping. Nothing. Well, where am I planning to go then? That's not going to be guards' quarters. That staircase doesn't go down further. That. No, there's a stairway here, maybe. It doesn't go up, it must go down. Okay. That's the new destination then. Because we've got a damn noisy floor on the way there. Let's follow this guy, see if we can get some kind of place to hide in here. Yes, cool, we can hang out in this room. In relative safety. Oh. Almost got me there. Do you want to go that way? That's where I got caught before. Okay, so there's a gate. There's a gate right there. That's where I got... Oh, this is not where I got caught. Okay, there's a gate on that whole section. This is indeed stairs down. Wait, this is the stairs down to the basement. This is the other stairs down to the basement, isn't it? Haven't I been down these stairs? No, I guess not. Oh, wait. Yes, I guess I have. I've been here. Right, I didn't go up those stairs I all the way. I just looked up and concluded it wasn't where I needed to be. So... Where the hell is the guard quarters, then? These guys at the wine cellar. Not through there, surely. I might just take this guy, these guys out, because it will save a lot of trouble, I think. We got past them. They know nothing. Jon Snow. How? You just turned around on the spot. That's nice cheating. Let me, let me cheat too then. God, he's coming too. Well, I guess we're gonna have two for the price of one. Oh, there's another guard down here? Start a collection. Don't worry. 
I'll find you. Well, then Archer is a problem. <sighs> I don't want the archers to actually see me. Come down, have a look around, find nothing, turn around and get back, and then he gets what? Come on now, come on. <sighs> if he sees me, I can't knock him on the head easily. And he will shoot me point blank in the face. I don't know, don't keep coming. You'll be full of holes soon! Yeah, that's what oh. I'm afraid of. Oh, shit. Ouch. Don't no. worry. I'll find you. Oh, he's coming. He's coming down here for sure. Actually, this is maybe a good place for him to come walking, because I can double back. Or... I can have escape route. He is good. Yeah, he's coming to hunt. As soon as I find you, you're dead. Don't worry, I'll find you. Perhaps you won't. Perhaps you won't. Those pillars. Very useful there. Alright. Uh, sure, we'll take the escape rope. <laughs> you always does that. <laughs> I, don't, I don't have those half veil mantles normally. I don't know what's going on with that, but. Okay, every time that happens, I just like. My heart stops in my throat. All right, well, guards know something up. They can't report to the captain, so it's all good. By the time I've come and gone, what do they report? There was a burglar broke in last night and stole everything. And it's like, yes, I know that, you fools. I can see that everything's gone. Everything's missing. I don't need you to tell me. All right, I actually want to be down there. I guess I'm going to take the stairs, because I haven't taken the stairs before. Oh, that's where I came in. Okay. You see, have I haven't been haven't been there before. Right, I want to get up there. <sighs> Easy enough. That's why I guess I could have done that with that archer there. I would have just waited for him to turn around. Well, don't I feel like a fool now? Also, I turn this off. No. Okay. I hate that. Don't put don't put them switches designed for the player to. <gasps> Interact with that they can't interact with. It's just, it's just messy. What the hell's that? I'm trying to decide if it's meant to be a chicken or a rabbit. I can't quite tell. Oh, so there's nothing here. Some garlic. Bundle of herbs. And this that doesn't that needs a key that I don't have. Weird, really this that's all. There was nothing here, nothing Well not quite nothing was coming for, but almost nothing. Bizarre. So this doesn't help me at all. There's no you know, there's a barracks in here, right? We... No, not here. We did pass a barracks somewhere, I think. Or am I confusing with the last mission? There's a machine room. There's nothing in here. This is damn storage, and there was nothing down there. Did we pass a barrack? We passed a barracks room somewhere up here, right? Here's the barracks. Hmm. I I'm harmless. Leave me alone. <coughs> That you, Cavill? I'm supposed to be asleep. Yes, the ghost got you, but whatever. 
It'll be fine. I didn't mean to run out in front of him like that. I was just like, okay, this is the barracks ish. But the captain of the guard isn't here. His key certainly isn't here. Where the hell would the captain of the guard be? Okay, where would the captain of the guard be? He's. Gonna have a better room than that, but I don't know where. I saw that training dummy and thought it was a guard staring down the hallway. Well, they're doing the job, the training dummies, if they uh, keep threatening the. Uh, the breaker in us. Okay, so this is also the basement. Um, where would the captain of the guard be? Guarding to Wolves place? No. Captain of the guard isn't going to be standing on guard anymore, right? They've got... Their job is not to be standing on guard. Their job is to be... Available. Maybe here? Maybe they've got an office there across from the security office? I didn't, I didn't try looking that way. No, that's the bathroom. Maybe upstairs. Am I just gonna have to scowl this place? That's, I don't like that. Run around until you find a place that vaguely seems to be where you need to be. I'm gonna leave these doors open. This is also a guard barracks, did I? Oh yeah, I read the journal. Yeah, it looks at this place. Wow, those pipes have been kicked around a lot. I guess the guards have nothing better to do to entertain themselves than wail on some pipes. Damn. So this one looks like the floor in the keeper place that was quiet. This one is pile, and I'm very annoyed by that. So what is this hallway? There's a gate over this side too, right? I think. Oops. No, I saw another gate somewhere. Well, maybe, maybe that was it, because I ran to the kitchen and went into the kitchen. Why is this gate only at one end of the corridor? What's it affecting? Not these paintings, they're not worth anything. That's the small dining room. I must have run in the, into this corridor. Yeah, I ran into this corridor. It's a guest bedroom. I suppose, just a... Unless this is Guy Captain's butler, and no, this is the butler's room. I shall dine in my private dining room again tonight. Tell the cook to prepare a quarter of beef braised with red wine, just like he did during Belle Purchase Eve. Bring me a Crumblier 7 with some lemon flavoured sorbet as well. As for my guests, tell them I am much too busy and shan't be able to receive them until tomorrow morning. Make sure the Duchess doesn't drink too much and keep an eye on this Yarnum fellow. Make them dine on the terrace outside so I can observe them from the greenhouse. Contact the Coachman Guild and tell them to have a carriage ready for the First City Bank and Trust tomorrow, near the third afternoon chime. You shall have the day out afterwards, but make sure renovations continue with no trouble. Antonin de Wall. Okay. Dining on the guests dining on the terrace. On the guests dining on the terrace on a night like this? Are you. I mean. Wanting to humiliate the guests by making them spend their time in the rain, I guess you might be. Ian, my esteemed friend, I write you this letter to confirm that this year's lodge of the butlers of the city shall take place at Miss Pennycuddles on the 23rd of Beneficus and shall begin on the ninth toll of the bell. Franz has managed to talk his master into letting him borrow some bottles of fine Solanian, and I've heard Duma is going to bring a few exotic trinkets. Lord Gervasus doesn't give a damn about any more. This will be a lot more interesting than last year's Grab Party Bistro organised. I'm sure, I hope he's not coming this year. His constant ramblings, whether he is the worst lunatic or extremely bothersome, 
As soon as we started speaking of something, he changed the subject back to his pompous supposed knowledge, treating us with contempt while talking gibberish no one cares about the hours on end. I wonder if he's this condescending and talkative with Lord Martin. He's one damned able gator, I'll tell you that. Perhaps I should get some wheat poison from my lord's stash, if he does in fact come to the ceremony. Anyway, who do you think will win the Who Has the Stupidest Master contest this year? My money's on Marcus, as usual. You don't make masters like Lord Baffert anymore. Still, some people are getting tired of his winning streak, but the game's the game, and the whole thing is absolutely hilarious. The look on his face gets me every single time. Sometimes I believe I will die of laughter someday. I don't get to laugh often, laugh often here. So, Ian, I count on your presence. With this prospect of seeing you there, your friend, Albert Defent. Alright, so that's the butler, which is across from the small dining room. Yeah. Right. Okay. Um, this... I don't know what these rooms are, but they don't, not really anything. Maybe here, maybe that's the captain of the guard. Would not be impossible. Okay, the guard is not from this way. So I want to get back to... I'm going to get back to that side of the house. Cutting through the basement is definitely still the easiest option. God, I almost got caught there. That was close. These doors are blocking in so much sound. Alright, uh, we cut across this way. Don't care about that treading on metal that happens there. And then that's the... Right, so we have to go down and then back up again. Is that right? No, where the hell am I going? This is a dead end. I don't know my way around anymore. <sighs> oh, up here. <sighs> up here. Okay. That's why I left the door open, to remind myself. But uh, did it help? No. Alright, so we're coming up, we've got this periscope to sneak out past, watch as these stairs. And I want to go around to the right. Captain of the Guard. Well, that's going to be useful. Nothing else up there. So what? I don't understand what the deal is with these periscopes. They're not setting off the alarm. That's clear. There's the other gate that I saw, by the way. Wait, that gate is right here, stopping any any exit from this place. Time. 
I don't understand. Can I break it? You can in craft left. Nope, everyone hears that from miles away, even though it's everything's really faint. That door seems to be cutting sound, but it isn't cutting sound. I'm not going to be able to pick that lock. Alright, well, I guess I need to keep looking around. Yeah, these dang security. <sighs> Don't have any plan for, get, for sorting it out. You want to close that? I should close it behind me. Let's try the gallery door. Because the gallery's not going to be guarded, right? There's only two periscopes in the gallery. This is a dumb idea. Oh, we're coming out here. Did they not mark that? I guess not. Only tons more tile floor. Two periscopes. Guards. Oh, a dirty lowlife. He seems rather proud of the fact he's poor. They say beggars take pride of that fact. Well, they know what they have can't be taken away. Why would anyone in the right mind want to take the poverty away? I didn't say the poor were smart. I said they were proud. <clears throat> Wait a minute, this map doesn't correspond to what I'm seeing, does it? Oh yeah, the periscope is... No, that's not a periscope. You weren't the captain of the guard, by the way, were you? Do you have a key on your belt? I mean, whoever you are, if you've got a key on your belt, I'm interested. No, you do not. <clears throat> but I heard something. Nothing. That's the last time I jumped on wrecks. I'd love to have a look at that, but uh, I'm used by... Oh, we're not in the gallery. This is the wrong floor. It's upstairs. Sorry, we're in the upper floor of the gallery. Right, the periscopes are downstairs. Yes, this is correct. Okay, so this is the family museum. Pool is through that way. Okay, so Lady uh, Arena the Wall is missing. Get our heart for luck. Lord Antonin de Wall. Lady Razor Louise de Wall. Lord Casimir de Wall. Basically, the same people as are uh, buried in the crypts. Wooden floors up here, it's a lot, a lot nicer than downstairs. I have been here before, this is this room, so the pool is downstairs, of course. The pool would not be on the upper floor. And the floors would not take the weight, so he's just walking around and around the pool, okay. Hey! What was that noise? Not taking any risks. Uh. You're gonna stand that close to me, then you're probably gonna walk into me, and that's gonna be much harder to deal with at that point. 
I like how you can just duck into these windowsills just enough. Really nicely done. There's curtains in front of them and everything. So where the hell am I going? Back here is the moss all cleaned up. I mean, I can try going upstairs to the... to the wall's place himself. Go, oh, why not? What have I got to lose? Just my life. I can pick this one even if I can't pick the security lock. Come on, come on, come on. The guy's gonna come out of the bathroom any second now. There he goes. I heard his footsteps. Upwards. Do any other food? Yes, good. Let's play it safe here. Jumped water arrow could save us a lot of strife. Okay, who's that? The guy with the sword does not look like the wall, right? Or maybe it is, he's tall and skinny. He's got a key on him. Yeah, I think that does look like what the wall to me, except... Why would he be... Yeah, what is he talking about, uh... Things. His face looks weirdly dead. That's oh my God, we need. Who's creeping around here? I've got his key. It's not the key I need. Won't let me turn the security off. What's my plan? How am I going to get through here? I've got, I can spend more moss here. I didn't really want to spend that one, but... I should have just crept across that bit to here, but never mind. Way. Who's creeping around here? Ah, I'm getting too old for that task. Chuck your key on the carpet here, sir. Okay, so this is private chambers. Nobody knows Captain of the Guard here, so this is not helping me with the main goal. multi-path problems, the sound's coming from the left, even though he's directly in front of me. He's going that way. Oh, what are we looking over here? Oh, is it a private stairway? Skull of Mott recommends the Wild North headpiece for the staff, but Ima was certain the piece was complete. <laughs> so, Algesis Demise, Don. Stone Market Catacombs, Catalyst for Revival, The Book of Ash, Tessari Far East, a real puzzle this one. Chalice of St. Grimal, Don. The test. Move to my private second floor study. Alright. Amethyst Heart, Portrait Manor, Viz Bow, possibly unstrong, must contact the Guild of Luthiers. My beloved wife, in my deepest dreams I can grasp your hand. Soon we shall be reunited and these shall be dreams. No more. That's his goal. He wants to get his wife's soul back. 
In your mind, imagine you've locked all your troubles in a box and tossed the box into a deep, deep ravine. As the box falls further and further away from you, wave goodbye to your troubles. They will never make their way out of the locked box. And even if they did, chances are they'll never climb all the way out of that very deep ravine. And from now on, you'll be a more relaxed and confident person. A trouble-free person. A person that can say the following out loud several times a day. I have thrown away my box of troubles. I feel relaxed and confident. If any more troubles come my way, I will put them in a box too and toss them into the deep, deep ravine in my mind. Reputo. See if your men can pry some more information about spirits from Balnebridge. I don't care how you do it and how much it costs, I just want more substantial material to go on. There's that built your bail on me and I need to find someone else to do the job. To say that I'm disappointed in your protege is a massive understatement. I was foolish to keep him alive. Blinded by the prospect of a dream finally fulfilled, he was supposed to offer me that harp on a gold platter. Have we not been clear about the importance these items have? Why has there been no progress? Why is he not dead yet? Find him and kill him. Do not fail me. Okay, so east. It's got a window looking east over a big square room. The library. To the walls. Private chambers. We could absolutely rip up that way. That might be my way out. And the private study is marked here, right? Okay. So that's the chalice in there. Where's our friend? Alright, there he is. Well, he doesn't decide to come and stand in this corner. We should be alright. We can scale the rest of his apartment. Whoops. Suddenly lit up by something. Isn't the problem with the... When you do... These really sharp edges is you'd be suddenly like, you know, whereas you should have a gradient. <laughs> so. <sighs> of Poisons and Beans and Their Antidotes by Willy Burtis Gilswar, first physician of the civilian hospital of Bone and member of numerous London societies, etc. While awaiting a physician that should be called for all cases, it is crucial to force the afflicted to throw up as promptly as possible by putting a finger into the mouth or by stimulating the uvula with a feather, feather barbule, if possible, after the afflicted drank plenty of lukewarm water. Only then, when the most nefarious poison effects are gone, the afflicted is to eat only fatty broth or fermental mixed with water. Solid fooders and liquids must not be administered for a few days. Narcotic poisons, black henbane, king's moss, poppy milk, etc. These poisons are fought with emetics. The afflicted is to drink coffee and acidic beverages after regurgitation. Herbal and mercurial poisons. Corrosive sublimate, grey ointment, thistle aid resin, etc. Prepare a beverage composed of six beaten egg whites mixed with one litre of water. The afflicted is to drink in quick succession until relief. Acidic poisons. Phosphorus and cantharides. Aquae fortis, aquae regia, vitriol, etc. 60 grams of magnesia to be mixed in two litres of water and the afflicted is to drink as much as they can. If magnesia is out of reach, it is to be replaced with soap at the same dose, or with diluted chalk. Bite from poisonous animals, bury play rats, seals, etc. Liquid ammonia is to be applied, or urine if no ammonia is found in the vicinity, with olive oil onto the wound, if possible after it is washed with brine. The afflicted is strongly advised to drink refreshing and soothing beverages. So he's clearly, uh worried about being poisoned. Well, that might ask the question why we're not going to poison him, right? Gold candlestick there. Can I, can I grab that without putting on this noisy floor? Yes. What about this side? No matching gold candlestick. You stingy miser. What about on top of this bed? Anything? Yeah, that's not the rope. <sighs> Nothing. Well, he didn't seem to hear me, that's good news. I don't know where he is though, that's the bad news. Bothersome. It's dirty tactics. No 
nobody steps on my toes. Yeah, his face is weirdly <coughs> lacking in detail. It's just like no shadow in it, it's just all highlights and midtones. Bathing in your bath. What if I pissed in it? How would you like that? <sighs> Judging by the sound that uh, Hume made just then, it sounded like he uh, took a shit in it. Sure, do all be very happy with that. Does he come in here? I think probably, but right? I think I think I've seen him come in here. Well, I think I've got everything I'm going to get from these chambers. I haven't seen his private dining room. That he mentioned. Unless... I mean, the small dining room. Maybe it's his private dining room. It had... the good gold plates, so maybe that's the case. Where is he? I just need to get out of here now. Tread louder, man. I can't hear you. I want to get across, I want to get down to the library, I think that's the way I want to go in. The stairway to the, near the security room is... fine? That's going to be my way to the security room, right? When I find the captain of the guard and get his key... When we take the, the wall's key is not the one that we need, right? The wall's key is for the safe, it's not for the... Uh, I should pick it up. Where is he? I don't want to go running out here because I can't see when I can't see where he is. Okay. He's moving again. Okay, I want to go that way. Alright, I don't think he'll see me. Go down to the library. <sighs> fine. Fine, fine, fine. We got down safely. We're out. Got the wall's key. I'm sure it's not the one we need. I haven't looted the library. So I guess I might as well. Someone does come and go, so I need to be careful of that. Oh, yeah. Where were they coming and going from? I heard a door opening and shutting, but which door was it? That one? Oh, there's a fireplace. 
There's only one door off to the library, apparently. Maybe it was the door down there. Maybe I'm fine in here. That's a nice map. The... That's the sort of thing I expect a map of the city to look like. Because that map shows building facades. That map shows the buildings in a way that you can recognize them from the street level, not outlines at the top. It's just because we're having a big discussion about maps and stuff. And it's like, the maps in this mission, I mean, it's not unique to this mission, I mind. It's basically the same kind of aerial maps. They show what the city looks like from above, which is a completely a view nobody would ever have in these times. During my voyage to Sierra Zan's most remote locations, I had the opportunity to quench my thirst for exotism by witnessing their peculiar occult traditions. One of them is so particularly macabre, I can't not speak of it. They call this practice Singpongma in their amphigoric religion. In our language, it is called Spectral Wedding. This barbaric custom consists of a grotesque parody of a wedding between two deceased persons, with the purpose of keeping them at peace in death and preventing them from coming back to haunt the living. I shared this strange discovery with my young guide when I came back to the embassy. As far as I could tell from my short study, this blasphemous practice is forbidden under the current dynasty, and it is only practiced by superstitious peasants living in the most remote villages, for there is an important morbid trade in this secular cult. My young guide hushedly told me of a sinister case that occurred in the village of his birth, a young woman was freshly entombed, then exhumed the next day to be sold to a family, and then exhumed yet again the day after to be sold to another. See corresponding chapter, pages 624 to 649. Okay. Quiet here. What? Oh, because he heard me. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. An accidental mantle fail resulting in... I'm just gonna loot the library again. How did you not hear that one? Alright, well, yeah, he did. Dang, mantle fails. That's a really awkward height. A higher mantle doesn't do that. A lower step doesn't need a mantle. It's just super awkward. I mean, I wouldn't mind in normal cases. It's like, ah, sure, someone heard me. They're gonna make a record. But here it's like, he heard, here's you. You fail. GG. Alright, whatever. We're getting our loot. We have quick save and quick load. I use them a lot because of problems like that. The interior window looking out of here is a really nice concept. Right, he shouldn't hear this footsteps this quiet. They shouldn't have to creep crawl around here. I hope. Maybe this close, I might have to. So we only have the one way out of the library, so I have to go out this way. There's the periscope out here. That's the bathroom, right? Mm. Where the hell is the captain of the guard? This thing I don't want to have to look up. I've been all around up here. He's not the guy who's... Right, the guy coming and going from here was the guy... Shit. It's a bad place to be. God. Fucking camera. So 
we know there's a guard patrolling this way with the dogs, so I can't stay here. I don't know how the dog is set up, but it ought to sense me if it comes fairly near, right? I mean, obviously a real dog would have seen me in another place. Okay. Um... We've done the library. We've done the private chambers. We've actually done the family museum. I don't know if we've done all of this properly. But looting wise, why for looting wise? I haven't been down there, but that's downstairs. Ballroom, I haven't been in because it's a stationary garden and the whole floor is noisy. It's just ridiculous. Private study is the next target, I guess. Uh, I'm coming down this way. Maybe just keep going to shoot. Where are I? Which room is this? Well, this is, a, this is above the ballroom. <laughs> I heard something. There's a go. Oh well. There's a go the dog. Must do nothing. Above the ballroom is a different matter from in the ballroom with noisy floor. Come on, move on, move on. I don't want to be in this hallway when the dog comes I guess being a crossover really is lucrative. This lavish house makes me want to throw up and stuff. Guess it was no. Now he decides to comment on his. Taste. Uh, Hume, now you decide you want to. Okay. Well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode, to be quite honest. Um, when we come back next time, we'll be uh, checking out. I guess the guest room's here, the private study. Seeing if we can't find this dang security key, because we're going to need it sometime. And, uh, I guess I'll come back next time to find out if I find the key or not. <coughs> Wait, someone's coming. No, okay. Alright, until next time.